Well, Kelly, as of right now, that is still a mystery. But either way, Abdul Rahman still faces charges of arson and using fire bombs after sheriff's deputies say he threw several Molotov cocktails over this fence, hitting his own car that was impounded in this lot and setting it on fire. Now, deputies say this all happened around 430 yesterday when Abdul Rahman apparently came to all makes auto sales to pay to get his car out of impound. According to the arrest documents, the owner of the shop told deputies he told Abdul Rahman that he would meet him at the lot shortly to get the car out. But when he showed up, Abdul Rahman wasn't there. The owner told deputies he then left the shop, but soon after got a call from one of his employees saying one of the cars was on fire. The owner came back and looked at surveillance video, which he told deputies showed Abdul Rahman throwing four Molotov cocktails over the fence and onto his car. The owner was able to put the fire out with an extinguisher before firefighters arrived, but told deputies he wanted to press charges. It started getting pretty high, the flames, and I could have lost a lot. You know, I work hard to get this. So it's just, I'm glad nothing else happened, and I'm glad they was able to catch him and put him where he need to be. Now it is still unclear why Abdul Rahman decided to set his own car on fire, but tonight he still remains behind bars at Orange County Jail. For now live in Orange County, Kelsey Thorid, West 2 News.